any body of water saturated with sewage or slaughterhouse wastes can be quite appealing to sharks. Most know him as the friendly face of Captain Winky's fish and chips. In real life, the pirate was a genocidal monster who murdered and enslaved thousands. understands that she needs to eat essential minerals to stay healthy and grow. As with many social movements, the annual Driftwood Man Festival purports to foster progressive change, but it's really just an excuse for hippies to flout public nudity laws.
Clovis's communal guard against shark attacks came after experimentation with animal sacrifices to appease the shark god, Dakiwaka. Say what you want. Them hobos, good workers. Unlike my so-called son, Kyle. That's why I pay him to stay on the lookout for that shark. is about saving lives, but it's also about safeguarding tourism around. Savage Shrimp.
Despite poor Clovis' best efforts, the aquatic beast refuses to be taken. The powers of society have retaliated with deterrent action, but mankind is ultimately impotent to stop Mother Nature's vengeance. Man special overlooking breathtaking panoramic lake views. Open living with vintage appeal. Call Deborah. Even for sharks, it's important to create personal time for sober self-reflection.
ocean is home to more species than any other environment on Earth, all of which must eat to survive. As one can see, routine micro practices of risk management haven't really been effective in cleaning up this area. The rover is always swimming, searching for anything to satisfy the blood that is going to find the truth.
sharks must occasionally be reminded that they are not the uncontested lords of the deep. While the state of Dead Horse Lake is alarming, we can be assured that a new era of environmental stewardship will restore order to our treasured wild places. <laughs> Mutagen 23 is certainly heating up the evolutionary arms race. from Adam. If he kill another fisherman, that's between them and him, yeah?
Golden Shores was built as vacation residences for wealthy out-of-towners, with spectacular ocean views, private beach access, and a gate to keep out the locals. Quiet space is the ideal stage for the shark to meditate and harness her pure potentiality.
entirely migratory, with the ability to travel across entire oceans. Why this one would willingly stay in Port Clovis is beyond me. The ferocious fear has spotted its activity. I didn't expect that to happen. Destruction of natural coastal habitats is sometimes necessary to build vacation homes for private equity fund partners. Kingfish in the mood, quite like watching a 73-year-old hit a double bogey. The fact that they've turned the waters off Baton Tordu into a spawning ground attests to their love of seniors' golf.
A shark is relentless in its pursuit of their quarry. that live close to shore are well aware of the human buffet that resides there. another reckless campaign of extermination. While hunting bull sharks was made illegal in 1997, many shark hunters get around the rule by not doing it.
for our crew to earn the Shark Hunters' trust, to convince them we were not insurance investigators questioning their disability claims. The fishing phenom, Candyman Curtis. resistant skin can now be used for wallets, key fobs, gun holsters, and other fine leather goods. The likelihood of catastrophic risk scenarios wasn't really considered when developers built a golf course in a flood zone. killing beautiful animals for tasteless nutritionless body parts than a $450 round of golf. easily identified by their conical snout and crescent-shaped caudal fin. The Golden Shores import this mako from Sri Lanka and train it to guard their community? Not likely, but let's pretend they did, as it makes for a more interesting storyline.
chorus of ankle bracelet alarms fills the air as shark hunters lead their homes to track our bull shark. The fishing phenom, Candyman Curtis. situation has escalated, and the price on the shark's head has risen. It seems Port Clovis has forgotten all about its rogue shark, for now. She should probably spend less, save more, and start researching indexed mutual funds.
USGA Rule 4.1A2 might have saved these damage clubs from abandonment. Consistently the most difficult hole on the course, many golfers struggle with this par 7 humdinger. shark is an animal of broad dietary proclivities.
Upon using this medication, if you experience priapism, do not attempt to improvise your own surgical shot. Despite the catfish's highly developed auditory system, lab tests revealed they still prefer CDs over vinyl. This mineral supplement wouldn't be necessary if this shark ate a more nutritious, well-balanced diet. The Sultan of Speed, the Mako. Mako made -o short work of its plucky challenger. Golden Shore's development was originally met with local protest, but those objections were easily circumvented with campaign donations to Planning Commission Director Steve Traeger.
Killers kill for the same reason we all do. To feel complete. out for our shot. Hunters are on the water bringing their explosive and more impulse control with them.
if I told you they were a prominent Holocaust denier? Okay, that's not true. But what if it was? This shark's cartilaginous skeleton can now benefit humanity as a medically unproven cure for eczema, phlebitis, and peptic ulcers. As coastal communities face ecological collapse and ruin, it's still reassuring to know you can get in your 18 holes. shark is unaware, the noose around its neck tightens thanks to a great team of shark hunters. Coast stopped growing cotton and rice and started growing luxury vacation. Humans' attention spans are short. They've already forgotten about the shark and her many crimes, so thus ends the bounty.
shark should consider returning to the water. actively seeks out sharks only to destroy them. Golden Shores was built on an elevated coastal hazard area, and while they don't have any disaster prevention strategy in place, I'm sure it'll be fine. I didn't hear a lie.
safety of the public, a bounty has been placed on the fugitive shark. Shores. Got a shark situation. Bad news? Another shark attack. Good news? has grown bored, leaving our shark to fight another day. Hockey sticks are still legal according to Baton Tordu course rules, but not for long if membership director Doug Thompson has anything to say about it. Golf ball diving is an exciting and growing field where you can risk alligators and venomous snakes for 7 to 10 cents per ball. Sultan of Speed, the Maker. A stalking shark is a mysterious ballad governed by unknowable agencies. Pelagic beasts 
surveys the scene with cold, unfeeling eyes. Short work of its plucky challenger. Historically, overdevelopment of the shoreline leads to a wide variety of negative environmental impacts. But you should see the Italian design walk in closets inside these condos. Sultan of Speed, the Maker. Waste little time hitting the water when a shark becomes a threat to human life.
Brutal Wheaton area mix should be called a Woodle or Wheat. Yes, It's another unsuccessful shark hunt for the people of Port Clovis. Sinking sharks, a lot more better than sinking putts. The hunt is over. Even for sharks, it's important to create personal time for sober self-reflection. I have one of those new pop-up tough stoppers at home, and let me tell you, those things are just a magnet for hair and debris.
fish are cavity nesters, so mind your crevices. There are 70-year-olds who survive gator attacks with nothing but a golf club. Come on. According to the county administrator, Chuck Hucklebridge, the lack of effectiveness of piecemeal technocratic solutions here can only be solved with more piecemeal technocratic solutions. fatalities caused by giant catfish than sharks, such as the Amazon Basin or Splash Mania Water Park in Garland, Texas. The 
Seawolf has detected vibrations in the water and is searching for their source. an alligator. Shark showed plenty of heart, particularly in